If you like our video, click the button to subscribe to our channel and get easy access to new content. To see our full suite of ad-free video courses, instruction manuals, and quick reference guides, visit us at www.teachucomp.com. When you receive inventory items from a purchase order, you have to enter the items into inventory to sell them within your sales forms. Sometimes you receive these items without a corresponding bill. In this case, you create an item receipt that you can later match to the vendor bill when it finally arrives. To create an item receipt for items received without a bill, select Vendors, Receive Items from the menu bar. This is essentially the same process as entering items received along with the vendor bill. So, in the Create Item Receipts window, select the vendor from whom you are receiving the items from the vendor drop-down. If the vendor is one with whom you have open purchase orders, an Open POs Exist message box then appears. To receive the inventory, click the Yes button in the message box to open the Open Purchase Orders window. Any open purchase orders you have with the selected vendor then appear in this window. Click to place a check mark into the leftmost column of the row that contains the purchase order for the inventory you received. Then click the OK button when you are finished to return to the window. The purchase orders items then appear in the Items tab at the bottom of this window. Ensure the quantities are correctly shown. If not, you can change the quantities if needed. Notice that the Create Item Receipts window is simply the Enter Bills window with no check mark within the Bill Received checkbox, which makes it an item receipt only. When the bill does arrive in the future, you then match it to the appropriate item receipt to enter the bill for the inventory at the time it is actually received. To help you find this particular item receipt in the future and also help distinguish this item receipt from any others, type an item receipt code or other distinguishing information into the Memo field. This helps you to match the bill to the item receipt later when the bill finally arrives. Then click the Save and Close button to save the item receipt and enter the items received into inventory so you can sell them within your sales forms. Remember to click the Subscribe button to see more of our videos. See our full suite of courses, instruction manuals, and quick reference guides at www.teachucomp.com.